Alrighty, today I wanna to teach you how to use and set up the buy one, get one free beta feature, all right? This is what it looks like. Uh, you can see it in action here, I added the second product for free to the car automatically. Uh, and we've got this beautiful widget uh, that sits on the product pages that have been targeted by this offer. Now, disclaimer, this is not the end form of this campaign. It's going to eventually be built within the Monster Cart app, but for now we've fast tracked it and made it available to everybody if you need to use it, because so many people have been asking, asking us for this. Uh, we figured out a way to implement implement this within the theme editor and utilizing Shopify automatic discounts. Enough about that later, I'll teach you how to set this up. But for now, I just wanna let you know this is not a normal way uh, that we would normally run campaigns in Monster Cart, but it does work really well. We've been testing it um, with other stores and it's working fine. If you have any issues with it, reach out to the team. If you need any help setting it up, fully reach out to the team. But without further ado, this is it here. Uh, there are a few things I wanna run through first uh, to make sure that you're aware of the limitations of this beta uh, feature that we've created and just set live for you, okay? Um, first of all, here we go. Um, what are the offers that can be done? So you're looking at buy X amount of products, get one free, all right? Or buy X amount of products from a collection, get Y free, or get a product for free, okay? And it automatically gets added to the cart and taken away when those uh, when it no longer fits the uh, purpose or uh, the unlock amount that's needed, all right? Uh, offers you can't do, buy one, get two free. Uh, these are limitations currently. Eventually we'll build this stuff, but buy X, select free product or variant from a product, okay? So there's no like options to select things around that free gift. Right now, it's limited to the first variant of a free product, okay? Uh, of a product, okay? Um, and the beauty of this offer as well is that you don't actually have to create a second free gift product like you normally do for the add to unlock campaigns which are in Monster Cart. Uh, you don't really need to take notice of that if you're not gonna use any of that stuff. Uh, but long story short, um, you can only give a free gift that, uh, and it will automatically add the first variant of that gift so be careful if you're giving away like clothing or something like that with sizes that is not something I would suggest to do for a free gift do something like a gadget or like a hat or something like that that has no variant selection needed so spend X get Y one free okay it's not a spend amount get something for free you can use add to unlock to do that uh, that is one of the campaigns options if you haven't used it already uh, we don't recommend buy one get one X percent off, okay? So it's possible to do that with this offer, uh, and, but I don't recommend it. It just kind of looks a little bit clunky and doesn't work exactly how you'd want it to. You don't want to force a customer to buy an, a second product for 50% off. Um, you can let them select it, so you could just uh, show it on the product page and create the offer on the back end, but what you don't want to do is just automatically add that product. It's not the best user experience. Limitations, um, due to being a beta, it removes monster discounts as well. As you can see here, we've got a add to unlock campaign that's running inside of Monster Cart, and it's got a 15% off offer, okay? And because this buy one, get one free utilizes uh, Shopify automatic discounts, they will override any other discount that has been created within Monster Cart, okay? So, uh, so you can see this 15% off here. If I click on add to cart, here we go. You can see as soon as this gets activated, it gets activated, the 15% off disappears and gets overridden by this other offer here. So it's not compatible with other discounts that are created within Monster Cart. Uh, you cannot select a gift variant. I told you about that. You only get one gift choice uh, and you can only run one buy one, get one free offer at a time currently with this uh, setup. Now, uh, let's move on. How it works. One, you create the discount within Shopify first, uh, the buy one, get one free offer. I'll show you how to do that with automatic discounts. And then number two, you create the function and the widget design within the Shopify theme editor. I'll do that second, okay? Let's move forward and let's get this created. All right, so what we wanna do is navigate to the discounts section and then we're gonna create our buy X, get Y discount. So ignore all these other discounts. This is the one that you wanna use uh, for this feature. And the next thing we're gonna do is click on automatic. And then we're going to type the name uh, that we want to display within the cart when this is active. So it's buy uh, one, get one free. So you can put whatever you want here. That's just what I'm gonna do. Uh, just so it sits nicely. All right, uh, and the next thing we're going to do is we are going to make sure that minimum quantity of items is selected because this will not work with purchase amounts. So we're just gonna click this one selected and then we're gonna put in one. So buy one of the specific product that I'm about to choose and we're gonna get one free, okay? Uh, you can have multiple uh, quantities of items here. So you could have buy three of a product or buy three of a collection. Uh, that's completely fine too. You can use products or collections to trigger this offer. Um, so we're going to choose the product uh, that we are going to run this on right now. So I'm gonna choose the pulse neck massager. 
there we go. And we are going to go buy one, get one free. We're gonna do the exact same thing here, pulse neck massager again. So we're gonna make sure that we select the exact same products and then we're gonna click on free. And that's it, so it's buy one of this product, get one free. You could do collections uh, and you can do more quantities if you would like. Everything else here is up to you. Um, what you can do is collect, uh, select the combination uh, discount options here. So you can make this combine with other order of product discounts, so other discount codes that are added at the checkout. Um, but I just wanna reiterate, it will not, this offer will not also work with a Monster Cart discount. They are incompatible right now. Eventually they will work together. I'm gonna deselect this for now. Uh, and then all you have to do uh, once you're happy with everything is you just need to click on save, okay? And that will be active on your store. And the next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna navigate over to our Shopify themes section where we're going to customize our live theme right now. What you can do as well is you could set this up on a duplicate theme first, make sure that it's all working, and then you can set that duplicate theme live onto your store uh, once you are happy with how it's working. That's another way you can do that. So you can click on duplicate here and then work within one of these themes here. But I'm just gonna do it on the live theme right now. I'm gonna click on customize, and then the next thing we're going to do is navigate over to our product section. Here we go. And here we go here. Now, um, you can see there's an offer that's already been created here. I'm just gonna delete this uh, for this video, so I'll just delete it for now. And we're gonna create it from scratch. Now, uh, what we want to do is make sure that we are on uh, the product page that we want this to show, or one of the products that is within the collection uh, that we wanna show this within. All right, so the way that we do that is we go up here and we click on this section up here, and we click on change, and then I'm gonna type that product in, pulse. There it is. So this is gonna change the screen preview over to Pulse, and then we're gonna create our offer, all right? Um, here we go. So first thing we're going to do is we are just gonna come over to this section over here and we're gonna add a block, okay? We can do it that way, or we can click these little pluses that up here. Uh, I'm gonna do it over here though first, and then we're gonna scroll over to the app section, and then we're gonna find this, buy X, get Y, beta, okay? Um, Gonna click on this and it won't show anything yet. What we have to do is we actually have to click on it again and we're going to edit this and create our offer. So I'm gonna change this to one. When a customer cart includes quantity one of a specific collection or product. Okay, so I'm gonna click on the product here. I'm going to type in pulse, boom. There we go. So when a customer cart includes one of this product, then automatically add, and then we're gonna choose another product. So Pulse, there we go, select, there we go. So to uh, summary, summarize, so one, when a customer cart includes quantity one of this product, then automatically add this product, boom. Perfect, okay, and there's a few other options in here uh, that are great for design and things like that. So um, for some reason, it's not showing. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna scroll around and see where this is, because once you've selected these two and added these to here, it should actually show over here. So I'm guessing it's just down a little bit. There it is, it's in the wrong spot. That's okay, because what we're gonna do is we're gonna move it. So I'm gonna click on this. I'm actually gonna change back over to this section here, and you can see this new block that's been added. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna move it to where I want it. I'm gonna sit it here underneath the buy button. Okay, so I'll just scroll up, it should move once this loads. Yep, it's loaded, so it's sitting there now. Buy one, get one pulse neck massager. Okay, and what we're gonna do now is we wanna edit the look of this uh, and get it looking nicely on our store. So all we do is open it back up again, or you can click on this and it will highlight and it will allow you to come in here and edit the design and make it look different. Um, so you've got all these different here, so different options here. So it's buy one, get one pul pulse neck massager. So I'm just gonna say, I'm gonna change this to buy, one, get, one, free. All right, there we go. And you can see that loading up there. It will automatically add it here in a second. There you go. Uh, and then the text colors and everything are all good for me. Uh, one thing I will do is when it, where it says border size here, I'm gonna get the team to change this to curve, okay? But I like a little bit more curviness. So that's actually this curve that's gonna be on the corners here. Um, let's just give it a whole heap of curve. There you go, so now if I click up here, you can see, okay, it's deselected. Yeah, there's the curve. Looks beautiful, so free gift, uh, one times pulse neck massager. I'm actually gonna remove the one times, so uh, that's the last thing I wanna do. Um, here we go, so get quantity, so free gift, there we go. And it should load in a second. Voila, there we go, that's nice. I'm happy with that, it looks really good. Uh, and once I'm happy with everything, all I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna set this live. Here we go. So I just hit save. And now if you're on a duplicate theme, 
What that's going to do is set it uh, live within the duplicate theme, and then you've got to push it live to your actual store, uh, publish it. Um, something to note is that this here, um, this section here has been added to every product page, but it will not be shown on any other product page, okay? So if I go, uh, a great example of this is if I just go over to another product page, let's just go to this one here, which is the original one that I was on when I first opened everything up. Um, if I have a look in here, you can see Pulse Neck Massager. It's it's not showing on the product page because it's not, uh, it hasn't chosen this product to be one of the triggers. It's only gonna show on the Pulse Neck Massager page. Or if I just alternatively chose a collection, it would show on only collection pages. So that's something that might confuse you a little bit, but basically it's uh, attached to this product theme, all right? uh, which means it will uh, show here, but it's not actually going to appear on the actual page. Now, if you have any questions, um, so that's saved and that's live right now. Uh, yeah, if you have any questions, please don't hesitate to open up the app here, uh, the Monster Card app, and reach out to the team. We are more than happy to help. Uh, this is a little bit tricky to set up and we will eventually build this into a, cam into a campaign option that's going to be super simple to set up. But for now, we just needed to rush this so that you guys can use this uh, and get it active on your store and making more money. Woo! Peace out and happy upselling.